the day that the Lord has made. We shall rejoice and be glad in it. Hallelujah, hallelujah. To God be the glory for all the good things He's done in our lives. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Love you. But what's the thoughts that's going on? See, I think, you know, the other voice we have, right, the best competing voice we have is us. Is thoughts kind of like voice too, uh, Brother Asa? Yeah. The inner voice. The, yeah. the inner voice, isn't it, right? The inner voice. So, so, so a person can say, by his stripes, I am healed verbally to whoever who want to listen. But what it doesn't matter if his thoughts doesn't line up with that's coming out of their mouth. I, I think that Jim, I think what Jimmy just said is subconscious. I think it was, when we talk in terms of our heart, yeah. If our heart, you see, because we have to believe in our heart. Yeah. If our subconscious has to be programmed to the point that we are receiving this stuff, regardless yeah. of what we're saying with our mouth, we still don't believe it. And you yeah, can't if really you don't believe it, you don't believe it. You just you know, don't you believe say, it. You can say a whole lot of things. I can fly. I believe I can fly. Yeah, 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 I believe I, I believe I can fly. <laughs> it's, it's believing uh, in a thought, yeah. but do you really believe? Because if you ain't flying, then you don't believe it. If Jesus says so, we can fly. <laughs> it's, it's, that's a fact. If Jesus said we can be like Peter said. If it's you, be me walk on the water. Yes. But there's no other foundation for that. I don't think I can fly. Of my own accord, I know I can't. <laughs> I don't think I, I don't think I can anyway. It's, it's, it's believing is believing a, a another means of communication inwardly. Is believing I'm trying to say is believing communicating something to you internally. Is it you know you just, how I say, like, well, the reason I brought those scriptures up is saying is, just to use for example, these scriptures saying is, Jesus knowing their thoughts said, wherefore thinkest thou even in your heart? Jesus knew their thoughts and said unto them, every king divided against himself is brought to desolation. I, what I'm looking through this is believing, is believing anybody. Is that some form of community? How do I, is, is commu believing communicating? Is no. believing, no. what is it? No, believing is is receiving. Yeah. And 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 that is receiving a communication, receiving a uh, anointing, receiving what? information. It's it's it the first is, communication though. Huh? It just so it is some kind of form of communication. Still. It's a communication. It's a it's, it's a, an exchange. A vehicle it's of exchange it's of information. Importation and exchange information. Yeah. Right. In other words, I'm saying is just like a thought is believing also a aspect of thinking. Yeah, definitely. Because unbelief is an aspect of thinking. Of thinking too, right? I can't do this. It's, it's something that happens in our psyche. Yeah. The, the soulish part of us. The soulish part of us will either receive or reject what God is saying. Yeah, so it's acceptance or yeah. rejection. Right. In other words, something is going on, and I guess it's in the form of a thought too, right? It's, a, it's, it's, it's what's going on in here right here right yeah. what's going on in your spirit and what's going on in this, this thing right here that's so but, powerful man that yeah that's powerful. what i'm thinking is that believing if i'm believing i'm actually i'm communicating to myself this is real the validity of where we have mentioned it yeah yeah, yeah. And, and you process that probably even acting on it come on now right and, and that's why the healing either occurs or doesn't because you're gonna, you are literally mentally processing this. And we say imaging that the mind and our imaginations, and you see yourself healed. Well, Ooh. did you receive the information from God that you were healed? Exactly. Did you receive the information from God? Did you receive it? Did you accept it? Right. And if you accepted it, now your mind is going to begin to process events from that. It's going to be in the reckoning in accordance with that information. Exactly. And then you're going to see the manifestation of it in the cardinal realm, in the material realm. Woo! And, that's, and I think this is where we have, this is where we're going to, this is where God is bringing us to. Because he said that, you know, if we believe anything is possible. Yeah. To those who believe any and everything is possible to them that believe. Right. So, but believe what? We'll believe the truth that he has spoken. He has spoken. I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man comes into the Father by me. What he says is truth. Woo! My mind received those truths. Right. That is 
exercised in that area to the point where it's going to it's able to image and manifest those truths and that's what he says about it said oh what he says uh that you might prove what is that good and perfect and acceptable will of god it's your 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 actions on that belief oh yes. it's, yes. it's it's when it becomes a part of you part of it you functions uh-huh or it's, it's a part of the the uh uh, the program, your programming, yes, yes, yes. this is accepted into your programming. So when that's how you function, yeah, that is belief. Because you can, you can believe that by His stripes you're healed uh -huh, uh -huh. until you believe something else. Okay, okay. You know what I'm saying? Something that that actually takes place over that yes. word. Yes. yes. Yes, no sir. different than here we go right back to the garden yeah. it's what you the information that you accept yeah oh. that allows you to act on it no oh no you're right because because they they acted on what they believe yes which they was did. not of god wow the last the last bit of information wasn't of god so in it to me now this johnson is y'all pray for me any information that comes from a source other than God. Yes, sir. It's a, it's a lie. It's a bad information. It's a it's virus it. for your yeah. system. Yeah. Your operating system. And the key to it is that you believe it. Yes. You receive it. You act you on it. it. And and it. You act on you after you thought about it, right? You you is it right. about your thought process. Thinking That's is an action. Your process, thought process is if you act on it, that means that you accepted it. Yeah. yeah. And you, yeah. That's, so that becomes part of your, what's going on up here. That, your reckoning. It becomes part of your, your process. A, of a, a one-time thing until it's proven that that's not it. Or yeah. it could just be a permanent. Hmm. You got that. Most of the time you go to the world and say, yeah, and they shall lay hands on the stick and they shall recover. You folk in church don't believe that. Wow. If you tell people that Jesus Christ rose from the dead and he's yet alive, even folk in the church don't believe that. Mm. Now, there's some people in church that don't believe that Jesus Christ actually got up from that grave and that he's alive now. Yeah. But all of our belief system is built upon the reality of this man raising from the dead yeah. and being yeah. yet alive. Yeah. Now, how's our mind handling that information? No. How, 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 how do you receive that? Yeah but not receive healing. Wow. If I can receive that Jesus Christ was raised from the dead, then how could I not believe that I am healed? Yeah. What, what's the difference? Come on. What is the difference? What's, what's greater? What has more power been given to from God? Woo. So, I, I, it brings back uh, well, I was a so-called prayer warrior. <laughs> uh -huh. You know, one of those people that was in in, in front of the uh, the church that you would come up and and get prayer for. Right. If somebody would say, you know, I'd be like, okay, so what 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 do you come for prayer for? Mm -hmm. And they would tell me, and I at first I just did what everybody else did. Yes. I just went through just the, 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 the emotions, yeah. you know. But yeah. then, once I started getting this word in me, I got specific. Mm -hmm. You say something, you know, Ooh. I need healing. Well, by Jesus stripes, you are healed. Yes. They shall lay hands on the sick. Come on. And they shall recover. This is what the word says. I put my hand on them. And I say, believe what you have received, put your faith in that, and it'll be. And then I would say, are you healed? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm serious. I, Cause I ex I had expectations. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That was my, my belief. If yes. I'm doing it, then I believe it is so. Right. Yeah. Because based, based on God's word. Right. So I'm like, did, did, are you healed? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Then, so believe in the meaning. Well, Jesus, what what they you say, say, you know, 
they, if they just look at me and then I, I, I understand that it has not mattered, I said, well, it will come to pass. Wow. See, because you know, I, that the, the revelation I'm getting from that, guys, is that believing is my thought process. Believing yes. is believing yes. part of my thought process. Yes. It is your thought process. And look, and look, 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 look at this scripture here. Because the reason I'm going to throw that is, this is when God had an issue with man. I only gave you part of it in the, in the study scripture, but but as of Genesis six, five and six. Okay, but before before I read that, I wanted to say this. Go ahead, go ahead. I could read by His stripes I'm healed in the Word. Yes, sir. But it ain't. but when the Spirit tells me, yes, right, right, then I know I heard it from God. Right. So it is. Right. And to me, I'm saying is that, that means it becomes not not only just that, is that it becomes a, a a mechanism of thought process in your mind, in your heart. You see what I'm saying? Is is it's it, become part of you. It becomes it's, a micro. It's, when it, when it's a revelation, yeah. God spoke into my spirit. Yes. Those words that I have read right. become life. Yes. And they become my thought process, which yes. becomes my process. Yeah. My, my, my actions. Because I yeah. believe, right, my actions line up with what I believe. Yes. My belief lines up with what's going on in my mind, my thought. And, then, right. and when yeah. the enemy comes in, then immediately it's rejected because it don't line up. Word says. It's not lining up with his will. Yeah. You know what I mean? He said, that's why I think he said, my sheep hear my voice. I know them. They follow me. Yeah. Why they follow me? Because that's because part of me. I become part of what he is, not part of what I am or other people. And, and I think when he said that Genesis, look at that one right here. Okay. Because I think, I think believing is a, con a continuous process. It is. It is. The reasoning is a continuous process. Reason and we continuous. reason in accordance with our beliefs. Yeah. It's a continuous. So I, oh, Lord. Yeah, but do, do, do you want to reason? Do you want to believe? It doesn't say. Well, when, when, when I, when I, I, by reasoning. When, when, I, when, I, when, I, when I speak in terms of reasoning, it's how am I? And I just use this as a scenario if I can. It said, by his stripes, I'm healed, right? Yeah. yeah. What does that mean to me? Yes. I'm yeah. reconciled to the problem. Come on, brother. A reasoning tells me if I'm reconciled to the Father, then oh, how can sickness abide in my in my members? Yeah. Ain't no yeah. sickness in God. Come on, and brother. And I'll tell you, and I think I, I testified to this once before. Come on. Now, uh, I was riding down the street one day and I was having serious problems with allergies, with my allergies, I'm blaming them, right? With the allergies. And I was praying to God, I said, heal me this, heal me this, these allergies. You know, and I got that going on because I'm mad. It's like, how come I'm a son of God and I got to go around dealing with these allergies? Yeah, and then yeah. he said, the, the thought came to me and said, are you one with God? And I said, I am. Because, of, you know, this is my stripes on you, my relationship with you. Yeah. He said, then yeah. the next thought that came was, you got allergic to anything. <laughs> and, and, and then the thought went, no. Oh, and my nose cleared up. Yeah. Immediately, yeah. my nose yeah. cleared up. It was this, it, and then I thought about it some more. Come on. And it came right Come on. back. <laughs> Because I couldn't believe what actually happened at that point. So I had this moment of clarity. Yes, sir. And then I went back into carnality as far as my thinking was concerned. Yes, sir. Now, was my body processing stuff? Yeah, it was, it was processing pollen, irritating my nostril. Uh -huh. And so my, my, my nasal passages were closing up in accordance with that. Right. But there was an override right. in the belief and in the healing. Right. God inside of me literally for a moment overrode what my body was processing or reasoning right and i think that's that's where it goes to we cannot well hallelujah Come on, we man. learn to Come on. allow our reasoning or our reckoning to be based on god's reality and not what we've been trained in the carnival exactly so I, <laughs> this stuff ain't, I don't think I had access to this prior to coming to know who Jesus is and becoming one with God. Because greater is he is in me than he is in the world. I was in the world. Yeah. So I pray to the cardinal system. Come on. So when, <laughs> when I came into the kingdom, I began to realize, and I'm still realizing. Yes, sir. How more powerful that it is than the, than the natural realm. Exactly. And you know, look, I'm gonna throw something at you. <laughs> Cause I like this. I'm getting I'm getting a revelation assistant now. Look, I'm I said the pain factor, right? 
elder. What? Well, how about the Abel factor? The Abel factor was, I'm giving the sacrifice. That becomes a part of his, you know, his thought process. That becomes part of his being. That becomes part of his routine. Is that my job is to give a sacrifice to God, right? Uh -huh. It, right. It, it becomes, you see what I'm saying? It becomes, it becomes a a norm thing for him, normal part of his life. This is normalcy. We, we we believe that we're supposed to do these sacrifice to the point that he even said, "Look, I'm gonna give the first, the first, uh, I guess sheep or whatever you call it, to 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 the to the sacrifice of God, honoring God for bringing more sheep, more." flock to me right amen, amen, amen. It, becomes, it becomes part of him yes and and, and 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 you know it's funny i'm not hearing in that, that chapter god talking to abel have you no no, no. you know what he probably because he's already <laughs> he already had the conversation <laughs> Come on now. and he's already following his will yeah. His will is part of the whole process. This is this is who I am. I, I'm, a, I'm a child of God, and probably Cain was trying to get him to change. That you might prove with that perfect and acceptable will. The will of God. Ah. Hey, brother, yeah. what he's in there saying is, you know, in all this, that chapter of Cain enables factor, right? Story. There's no conversation between Abel and God that, you know, in the scriptures for us, right? The scriptures not having a conversation with God and Abel. Mm -hmm. The conversation with the person who don't want to... <laughs> don't want to comply. Yeah. Do God. <laughs> you know what no law. Yeah. But, but what we're saying is that Abel was doing his part of his thought process part of his believing process, his action, right? Because you say action, if you believe in something, your action line up with what you believe. Mm -hmm. Most of his thoughts lined up with what he believed. And he was just performing and doing the will of God. And probably he probably got killed by Cain because he didn't want to change what he knows supposed to be the will of God. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. and, and, and the reason I wanted you to read this one was to show you <laughs> check this, check that out. Because this is the issue God had with man. Five and six of Genesis. Okay. And God saw that the wickedness of men was great in the earth. And that every imagination of the thoughts of his heart was only evil continually. That's the issue. And it repented the Lord that he had made man on the earth. Yes. And it grieved him at his heart. Look at that, grieving at his spirit. It grieved at his spirit, but the key I was looking at is continually. Yeah. In other words, imaginations and thoughts are all intertwined together. In other words, I'm imagining it, I'm faking it. <laughs> I'm, most cases, then that mean I'm believing in everything that I'm imagining and thinking and continually doing those things in the heart is evil. Are we doing that now? <laughs> yes, sir. Come on now. We're seeing it manifested right in the midst of us. And it ain't a racial thing. Now, I need, I need, I need to clarify it. Uh, Black lives matter and, and black people evil. <laughs> just as a norm, I gotta, I gotta go and put that caveat in there because we are deceiving it's a deceit it's a deception in the sense that we make that that statement as though we are set aside and everything else is all right with us all his sin and come short of the glory of god is a fact that is a that's a biblical fact i don't give you blue over it's, yeah it's, so now let's start at the real foundation of the issue the issue is we need to get saved the issue is we need to turn to god the issue is we need to pull our pants up we need to cover our big booties we need to stop cussing and then polluting the air with the garbage that we're throwing out there and polluting people's minds. And I believe we need to seek the favor of God and God will restore us to the rightful place that he was already elevated to anyway. Hey, look, and so, I, 
I want to add a caveat with you. I, I believe every last one of those suckers, white, black, red, red, you're right, you're right. All of them yeah. needs to, because that's, I think, maybe that's, the, maybe the interest is trying to say it, but the reality is every last one of us need to line up and follow the will of God.